Are you ready? Right, give me a minute. You know, this world is complicated and imperfect and oppressed. And it's not hard to feel timid, apprehensive and depressed. It seems that all around us, tides of questions ebb and flow. And people want solutions, but they don't know where to go. Opinions abound, but who is wrong and who is right? People need a prophet, a diffuser of the light. Someone they can turn to as the crisis rage and swirl. Someone with the remedy, the wisdom, the pearl. Well, they should have asked my husband. He's a man who likes his say. With his thoughts on immigration, teenage mums and Theresa May. The future of the monarchy, the latest Brexit shocks, the wait for hip replacements and the rubbish on the box. Yes, they should have asked my husband. He can sort out any mess. He can rejuvenate the railways. He can cure the NHS. So any little niggle, anything you want to know, just run it past my husband, wind him up and let him go. Congestion on the motorways, free holidays for thugs, the damage to the ozone layer, refugees, drugs. These may defeat the brain of any politician bloke, but present it to my husband, he will solve it at a stroke. He'll clarify the situation, he'll make it crystal clear. You'll feel the glazing of your eyeballs, and the bending of your ear, you may lose the will to live. You may feel your shoulders slump when he talks about the president, Mr Donald Trump. Upon these areas, he brings his intellect to shine in a great compelling voice that's twice as loud as yours or mine. I often wonder what it must be like to be so strong, infallible, articulate, self-confident and wrong. When it comes to tolerance, he hasn't got a lot. Joy riders should be guillotined and muggers should be shot. The sound of his own voice becomes like music to his ears. And he hasn't got an inkling that he's boring us to tears. My friends don't call so often. They've got busy lives, I know. But it's not every day you want to put a windbag, suck and blow. Google, safari, <laughs> on them we never call. Why bother with computers when my husband knows it all.